Welcome back to AA Cubert. Today I'm going to be teaching you to look OLL on the 3x3. There are different ways of solving a 3x3 Rubik's Cube. The beginner's method, I have a link here if you want to learn it. The C4 method, I'm currently starting it. Ru and ZZ. The C4 method, also known as the Frederick's method, is the one of the commonly used methods to solve a 3x3 Rubik's Cube. So C4 stands for, the C stands for cross, then F stands for F12 or first two layers, then O stands for OLL or orientation of last layer, and P stands for PLL or permutation of last layer. Today I'm going to be teaching you O means OLL, orientation of last layer. So OLL has, you can do OLL in two ways. There's to look OLL, edge orientation and corner orientation. Edge orientation has three arcs and corner orientation has seven arcs. And we have full OLL that has 57 algorithms. There are dot, T, square, C, W, P, I, fish, night move, awkward, L, light bulb, corners, oriented and crushed cases for full OLL or one look OLL. Let's start with the cross cases. For two look OLL you'll have edge orientation and corner orientation. First, I'll teach you the edge orientation parts. So there are three cases, opposite, adjacent, and none. So I'll recreate the opposite case. So here's the opposite. It's just a line. Make sure to hold the two edge pieces that are solved. Means not in their correct spot, but at least oriented on top. And hold them to your left and right. And do the formula F R U R prime U prime F prime. Next we have the opposite case, the adjacent case. So the adjacent case is like a L. So hold the L, not that it's facing upwards, hold it to the bottom. So one edge facing towards your front and one edge facing towards your right. And do the formula wide F or basically just F and the middle, the side layer and then R, U, R prime, U prime, wide F prime. So in the last case I'm going to be teaching you for edge orientation is none. So no edge is oriented. So the none case is just basically both the algorithms combined. So it's like F, R, U, R prime, U prime, F prime wide f r g u r prime u prime f prime so now we have the corner orientation case the first case is soon so the soon case is when you have one corner solved and to its right you have towards the right you have a corner that has red facing towards the front. So if you have that, then hold it from that orientation and do the formula R, U, R prime, U, R, U2, R prime. The next case I'm going to be teaching you is anti-soon. So anti-soon is just like the mirror of it, but in a different way you'll do the algorithm. So instead of having it like one corner solved and towards its right you have a red sticker facing towards the front, it's on the left side this time. So this time you're not supposed to hold it like this, the way that I have. You do a U2 from here, then this is the current orientation that you'll have to hold it from. So the formula is R prime, U prime, R, U prime, R prime, U2, 
are. So the next case is called the car case. So the car case is basically where you have two pointing towards you and two facing away from you. So you'll have to hold it like this and do the formula F R U R prime U prime R U R prime U prime R U R prime U prime F prime. Now the next case that we have is called blinker. So the blinker case is where you have two facing opposite from each other and one pair of headlights. So like this. So the blinker case, for the blinker case you hold it like this and do the algorithm. R U2 R prime U R2 U prime R2 U prime R2 U2 R. The next case is headlights. So headlights, there will be one pair of headlights right here and then you will hold it towards your front and do the formula R2 D R prime U2 R D prime R prime U2 R prime. The next case that we have is chameleon. So that case is basically like the headlights case but you don't have headlights you have facing opposite from each other. So the chameleon case you'll do it two facing opposite to each other on your left and do the formula y dot u r prime u prime y dot prime f r f prime and the last case that we have here is bow tie so the bow tie case you will have two corners facing away from each other so they'll be diagonal from each other don't hold the corners so don't so you don't see the color that's facing on top so i have red so don't see don't face it like this where you can see red face it like this where you can see red but don't hold it in this orientation hold it in this orientation so one towards your left and one towards your front and do the formula f prime R U R prime U prime Y So the formula is F prime Y dot U R prime U prime Y R prime F R and now you have your all your pieces oriented on the last layer. If this video helped you make sure to like and subscribe. Bye! Thank you.